All right, here we are, folks. I hit 654.3 kilometers before my gas light came on. Uh, everything's running normal. It's actually running uh, a little bit cooler. RPMs are lower. And there's my PWM. Right now it is hot to the touch. I need to install a cooling fan over it just to keep her nice and cool. The other side is just a plain Jane toggle switch. Let me uh, pop the hood and show you my new configuration. It's down at the ocean right now. Up the Can't really see it. But, uh, let me prop this open. There we go. Alright, there's my bubbler right there for, it's an acrylic cell. You can't really see the, uh, the cell body too much, but it's acrylic. And there's my second bubbler. Or, uh, I got them both mounted in the front now, so they get massive amounts of air drawn in across them, which is so much better. The, uh, the old configuration, I had one back there by the exhaust, but it's getting so hot. But, uh, there's both of them right there. I'll show you the, the water that's in the line, so it kind of goes past it a little bit. That's my intake. Everything's been going great so far. I can't complain. Uh, that wire I need to reroute to the firewall and up through here, but I just changed it last second, so that's what's going on there. But other than that, these cells have been running great. Uh, I switched to sodium hydroxide about 50 kilometers ago, so I'm thinking if I had sodium hydroxide throughout the whole test, I probably would have hit at least 700 kilometers. So, let me close this hood before the wind blows it off. Alright, let me show you my little bumper sticker that I have. Through on here. That wind's really howling. Check that out. I just ran it just to I'm trying to get other people interested so they can uh, throw the stuff in their car. Start making a difference. Oh, check that out, folks. I bought my next tank of gas already, and it's chilling in my trunk. <laughs> car runs on 13, uh, takes 13 gallons to fill up, so I've gone, uh, 654.3 kilometers on 13 gallons of gas. I'm not sure what that is in U.S. miles, but someone can tell me I'd be happy to find out, or happy to know. Check this out. Piece of stainless steel. Check out the, the vapors. Normally when it's not windy out, I got a huge cloud behind my car. But, uh, you can see some condensation around the ring there, but check this out, guys. Clean. Clean. It has cleaned out the carbon in my car so much. I, uh, I'm very impressed. Normally 450 kilometers is when I have to fill up, but, uh, now it's 64. So, hopefully you guys get the same results as I did.